Hello everyone and welcome to this week's game dev log on the Stars Are Destination, a turn-based strategy flight game. Finally at a pace I can feel satisfied with, but I still feel I can do better. Is that the imposter syndrome talking? I don't know. Let's get into it. This was a long time coming. Of course it's bare bones right now and needs some polish. Point is it works. In order to win, all the enemies have to be taken out. The player loses when the enemies either get to the mothership, or taking out all the player pilots. Still working on that part. This is mostly done by editing the individual player and enemy ship collision logic in their strategy scripts, and they call the manager. All it does is turn on whichever text, animation forthcoming, and teleports back to the hub world. Before, the Karen would just teleport when transitioning to a ship animation like the U-Turn or the Somersault. It wouldn't take into account the ship rotation or the camera rotation and reset back to the original rotation after the animation. Now it takes it into account and the rotation and the camera adapts to it. To further illustrate this, the rolling controller has a few modifying variables that are in charge of rotating the ship model, which is a child of the parent object, and what they do is rotate the child object depending on WASD or analog stick depending on what you're doing, without rotating the parent so that the camera work feels natural. I know that's a lot. Now they reset and adapt when triggering the animation. I made it so that the camera has enum states for specific parts of the process in the same way you'd make enemy states for enemy AI. It allows me to have custom lerp and slurp speed so that it isn't too jarring. After many, many flubs, it works now. The reason why the ship is stationary right now is because it still needs improvement when the ship's in motion. Long and short of it, the camera's trying to keep up with the ship when it's in motion and the rotation can get very screwy. Thinking of having the ship slowly adjust its speed so that the camera can catch up. This week in Small Victories is the minimap. Last week, the sprites within the minimap didn't look too great when they were diagonal. I tried using the Pixel Perfect camera component and got something like this. After a lot of out there methods, turns out all I needed to do was up the resolution of the texture so it was just fine. Insert dunce cap below in the comments. Next time I hope to get the hub world music in. I'm currently looking at multiple different sources and eras in music. If you'd like to know more detail about the music process, other than software obviously, let me know. That'll be it for this week, subscribe, and if you want to ask me questions, I'm usually in the Discord server. Let me know if you have any questions or feedback, take care of yourselves, and have a good week.